UMass Boston women's volleyball looking to stay alive in the Lilies Conference playoff hunt, currently trailing Southern Maine for that final six spot. The Beacons need to win their last two LEC matchups, while Southern Maine needs to lose their last two. Beacons facing West Con. Amelia Devlin with a highlight reel kill here with the backhand to help get the Beacons within four. And then a 4-0 run trailing 23-18, starting off with a Dylan Wurzberger kill. Helps pull the Beacons back within one as you see Wurzberger with the kill right there. And then Michaela Garrity following it up with a kill of her own over there on the left side of the court. Beacons trail by only three. And then Tony Guerra, who just made a nice diving play on the previous play, gets a service ace. The Beacons within two. And then an attack error by Taylor Rohan helps pull the Beacons within one, 23 to 22. However, Westcon would take the first set. 25-23 on the Elena Butel kill. So they go up 1-0 in the match. But then in the second set, the Beacons come back strong in a 5-5 game here. Starting it off with a kill by Garrity to go up 6-5, part of this 5-0 run. Wurzberger adding another kill to her resume on the night. Helps put the Beacons up too. And then Amelia Devlin with a nice little tap over helps extend the run. And then a service ace by Garrity. Helps keep the Beacons going, who were capitalizing on a lot of West Con errors early on. And then an attack error by Sydney Slapchuk helps put the Beacons in front by five. And then another highlight reel kill by Taryn Brogel in this one in a 10-6 match right here in the second set. A nice set right there, and Brogel just spikes it home viciously. She was on fire all night. And then Michaela Cleary, the freshman, with a nice block up front gives the Beacons another point, 13 to 10. And then the Beacons take control of the set up 19 to 17, go on a 4 0 run, started with an attack error by Westcon, and then a service ace by Taryn Brogel, followed by another Wurzberger kill, helps put them in front 22 17. And then again, it's going to be Taryn Brogel who finishes the job with yet another. Service ace beacons in front by six. Westcon would try and go on a little run to get back in it. However, Livia Trindade would put a finish to the second set with this kill right here. 25-21. Sets tied up at one all going into the third set. We're gonna pick it up at 21-20. Westcon Taryn Brogel with another electric kill. Pulls the Beacons even at 21 all, and then a 3-0 run for the Beacons who are on the brink of losing the set are going to end up winning it 26-24. We had six lead changes and six ties after it was 18 all in this third set after both teams went on massive runs early on. So we're going to head to the fourth set with the Beacons ahead 2-1, to one, and there's really not much to talk about from UMass Boston's end as Westcon got themselves back in it, looking to swing momentum their way with a big 25-13 to 13 set win to force a decisive fifth set. And the Beacons would answer the call and stay alive in this one. Six to five they lead and then they go on a big 4-0 run here, starting off with a block by Brogel and Trindade up front. And then Brogel is going to get a kill right here to help put the Beacons up 8-5. to five. And then a service ace by Trindade on back-to-back plays for the Beacons puts them up 10-5. to five. And now the Beacons eventually on the brink of winning this one as they're going to get this again, like we mentioned. Another nice service ace right there. Now it all comes down to the match point. It's 14 to 9, and an attack error by Taylor Rohan finishes the match. The Beacons stay alive and keep their playoff hopes intact. Amelia Devlin finishes with 34 assists. It's her third match recording 30 plus assists, and her seventh recording 20 plus assists. Trindade leading the way with 12 kills. Brogel with 11, four aces, and four blocks. The Beacons. Back in action next week against Emerson College will await the winner of the Southern Maine match on Saturday to see if their playoff hopes will continue.